What's up YouTube? This is DWS Darius and this is going to be another episode of Amazing Fish. And this week's Amazing Fish, the Neon Tetra. Okay YouTube, so right now you're looking at the Neon Tetra. Now these are some of the smallest fish in a fish keeping hobby. So I'm going to have a very hard time trying to fill them properly. So excuse me for that. But these fish are extremely amazing. Okay, so these Neon Tetras are not only some of the most smallest fish, but they're also some of the most common fish. Now every local fish store that I see and that I go into, they keep these fish. And no, there's no wonder why they would keep such fish. They're extremely amazing, super colorful, and just incredible to watch. So many people enjoy keeping these fish in, these in their tanks. Okay, so one of the things that I love about Neon Tetras is that they are a school of fish. And these fish depend highly upon their school because they're so small. And they pretty much use each other to look bigger and to gain more confidence in an aquarium with other fish. And um, I just love seeing schools. I made a video before about all the school and fish in my tank and the link is going to be above. But I just love school and fish and Neon Tetras are some of the easiest fish to school and some of the most beautiful fish to school. So that's one reason why I love these fish. Another thing that I love about Neon Tetras is just their size. These fish are small so it's nice to have different size. With me I like to have different size fish in my tank and to have nice decent sized fish and then the minute ones I just love the variation so these fish help bring a lot of just attractions to your tank to look at just different scenes and different motion sizes shapes and colors okay so as far as care for neon tetras these fish in my opinion are very hardy fish they're super easy to care for as long as you just give them what they need now number one the number one thing that you need to know about neon tetras is just that they're small when I first started I added five to my tank and that night they all were gone because they were eaten. So these fish are super tiny so you got to make sure there's no fish in here that's able to eat them. Now eventually these parasiclas will grow up and will be able to eat them but by then they're going to be gone from this tank. So just make sure when you keep Neon Tetras you make sure that you have no fish that can make them a meal. Another thing that you need to know about Neon Tetras is just that they depend upon their schools. If you keep one or two or a low number, you won't get as much activity as you would from a nice school. So if you want that constant swimming back and forth and that constant activity, give them a decent school. I recommend maybe seven or more because these fish just really are like brothers. They all depend upon each other and hang out together. So make sure you give them a nice decent school. As far as the setting of your tank, I recommend a planet tank just because they look awesome in planet tanks. That blue and red just looks awesome passing the green leaves but they don't have to be in planting tanks you can keep them in any tank you want so just do you when it comes to these fish okay YouTube so it's not really that much that I have to tell you about these fish because these fish are very common so just make sure you give them what they need meaning give them a decent sized tank give them nice water changes make sure you feed them properly no overfeeding no underfeeding and just show them that care as you would any other fish and these fish will reward you with just awesome schooling behavior and just a nice addition to any tank, any community tank that is. So this has been another episode of DWS Darius's Amazing Fish. As always, you're welcome to the Amazing Fish playlist, home to many other amazing fish. So make sure you check them out, the link is going to be above. And I just thank everybody that's viewing this video as of now and have viewed past videos and I will continue to view my videos. Thank you all for the support and the kindness. And this has been Amazing Fish. Stay tuned for more.